These two brothers were sending their dead father to be buried. However, the wrench of the coffin broke. And then, the old father jumped out of the coffin and flipped backwards for two one half somersaults into the water. Perfect. The passers-by are calling it wonderful, but this is not filial. Let us pray for the old father. After his death, the father left the brothers a factory that was on the verge of closing down. And a mansion, perfect for a ghost movie. The brothers were disgusted with the dilapidated house, but the house held a surprise they didn't expect. The brothers found a design plan and discovered that the house was over 100 years old. It was the work of a famous designer. This attracted the attention of celebrities from all walks of life. Everyone is a big fan of the designer. Then the value of the house instantly increased by down scenes of times. The two brothers were very lucky. They decided to clean up the house and then auction it off. And that's when the real surprise of the old house appeared. In order to sell the house for a good price, they didn't allow this mouse to exist. But it was not as easy to deal with as they thought. A mouse trap is not enough to subdue the clever little mouse. He ate the olives and left the pits to show his disdain. Then he graciously lays down in a bowl and enjoys his cereal. Lars raises his broom and hits Ernie on the head. The two brothers chase the mouse, but the mouse is so agile that they can't hit it. Ernie tried to hold the mouse down with his palm, but not surprisingly, his hand was hit by his brother's broomstick and it fell with him. The mouse wins this round. Ernie again took out the cheese to tempt and carefully prepared a mouse trap, but the two silly brothers don't even notice that the mouse has slipped away with a big piece of cheese. Now, the mouse is not worried about food. After the mouse had eaten and drunk, he lay down on a soft cotton bed. He was about to fall asleep when, suddenly a bunch of nails were stuck into the wall. It turned out that Lars was attacking outside. The tiny nails can be considered a blast for the little mouse. The mouse slips out of the tiny crevice. He hid behind the oil drum and prepared for a big surprise. The two brothers were scared out of their minds. Then they fell together in the tub and slid down the stairs. Is this a free skating experience? It finally stopped after three minutes. Suddenly the ice broke again and they sank to the bottom of the lake. The mice are really brave and strategic. The brothers laid thousands of mouse traps in the house to deal with one mouse. But they weren't very smart so they locked themselves in the house too. At that moment, the mouse slipped out of the hole, perfectly avoiding all the traps and agilely climbed to the high platform. Then he threw down a cherry. This cherry finally landed on the mouse trap. The mousetrap finally worked, but it was a human who was caught. The two brothers are crying and screaming in pain. The mouse wins again. Ernie was furious to see the mouse slip out of sight. He stuck the vacuum cleaner into the mouse hole. The mouse is now clinging to the wire, and his vacuum cleaner goes down the drain pipe. They were so happy they thought they were going to catch the mouse soon. And then... Here's a smelly video. The brothers' IQs were crushed by the mouse, and they had to bring in help. An evil cat named Tom, but I knew from the name alone that this would not work. A cat and mouse chase immediately began. Tom was still looking at the hole and chasing his target, but the mouse was already behind it and had set up a mouse trap for it. I think this mouse trap can trap people and cats, but not mice. The mouse led Tom into the elevator and then chewed the rope. Then Tom fell down the elevator. Tom also lost his breath. The brothers had to bring out the ultimate boss which is the rat exterminator with an undefeated record. But his way of tracking is to analyze and study the mouse feces and even test it. Eventually he analyzed the mouse mild calcium deficiency. The expert sticks the detector into the mouse hole, but doesn't find the mouse right next to him. Then the mouse made its move. The expert reconnected the detector. His car appears in the picture. The mouse connects the detector to the gears. Then he is dragged by rope with the gears rolling to the car in the snow. The exterminator is also abused by the mouse. The house also went from dilapidated to more dilapidated. When the brothers returned home, they saw a moving sandwich. It turned out to be a mouse underneath. Lars grabbed a pan and smashed it. Then the wooden shelves hanging on the wall came down. The mouse climbed down the chimney and Ernie followed him. But that chimney was getting smaller and smaller, and his round body was stuck. The mouse turned on the gas. Lars lit a match at that moment. His body went up into the sky with a flame from the chimney. The two brothers were furious. Before they could catch the mouse, they had an internal fight. Lars grabbed an orange and threw it at him. The orange missed Ernie, but knocked the mouse unconscious. With just one final blow, they were able to eliminate the scourge forever. But then the two brothers suddenly gave up. They have experienced a long tug of war with the mouse to play out the affection. So they left the little mouse alive and sent him to the post office to send away. But just when they wanted to focus on fixing up the house, 
The mail was sent back because it was overweight. At the auction, Ernie is auctioning off the old house. A small mouse appears at the auction. No! Didn't know what this! Something that a few nails! He hammers away but doesn't catch the mouse. Then the mouse appears on the woman's funky haircut. Lars sits down next to the woman and grabs the mouse. But the mouse slips up his cuff and into his dress. Lars breaks down and screams. The woman's hair also began to smoke. The more Ernie blew on it, the hotter it got. He grabbed a glass of wine and poured it on the fire. Now the woman's head was a lit torch. The auction was in chaos. Lars rushed to get the hose. Ernie takes the hose and shoves it into the rat hole to drown the rat. The auction goes on. Their house is up for sale for $25 million. But just then, a huge torrent of water rushes out from behind the wall. Everyone is swept out of the house. Ernie is still trying to hold the guests back. Now you know, this house will last forever! Well, okay. I now know that this house is going to collapse. Now the brothers have to sleep in a bankrupt factory. But the mouse has followed them. He turned on the machine and threw the cheese into the device thus creating a combination of cheese and string. This cheese ball instantly became the most popular thing. The brothers follow Mouse Hunt and use the cheese ball to make a fortune again. Mouse Hunt was released in 1997. It tells the story of the brothers fighting with a mouse. The mouse quick wit and the brothers' hilarious behavior create a comedic effect. I have to say that both the mouse and the brothers are very good at demolishing homes. The mouse destroys the old house, but helps them to make a bigger career. Maybe this is the way the mice apologize. This is the end of today's video. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you like it. See you next time.